<laughs> wow. That was not what I was expecting. Today we get to plant our strawberry starts. These are growing like crazy. They were pretty dormant when we got them last week and we have had them in some water. Took them out of water for a day, put them in water for a day because we didn't want to rot the roots but we weren't ready to plant so we had to keep them hydrated. And so what we did first is hydrated the ditch and then we're just dropping them in, alternating from one side to the other. I'm going to come back over and, and put a layer of compost and then the topsoil back on top. And we'll have strawberries this year. That's the one nice thing about strawberries is you can plant them in the fall or in the spring and you'll usually get strawberries the same year. Um, definitely if you do it in the fall. These are ever bearing strawberries so they're going to be producing all year long for us. I've got them basically like they're healed in. The roots are completely covered by a layer of compost and then I got to take these topsoil clumps and break them up by hand and just fill in the rest of the trench. Keeping a close eye on time. She is due today and she has been in early labor for like four days but her udder has definitely tightened up and she is Definitely showing signs that she's progressing more and more every time I check on her. What are we up to now? <laughs> wood chips. I cannot wait to get those in the paths in the garden and mulch the blackberries and strawberries we just planted and as the garden grows we'll start mulching around the bigger plants and keeping the weeds at bay and keeping the moisture just right. Wow Ryan you were busy while I was in with the baby. What could this be for? Hmm, I wonder, looks pretty good. Well, sometimes you miss it all together. We've got three babies. Uh-oh. Come on, come on, little guy. It must have just just happened. The fluids mm -hmm. are still warm. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. She is. Oh my god, she's having four babies. Oh my god. 
Are you still filming? Is it a baby? Uh, it looks like a... Or, or is it looks placenta? Like I thought I saw a nose. Are you sure? I don't see a nose right now. When she pushed, I thought I saw a nose. <laughs> That's another bubble. <laughs> Two placentas, that means she was impregnated in both horns of the uterus. You're still filming, right? Yes. Do not stop. Um, battery life. That's good. Watch, watch. That's a baby. Look. Yep. It I is. It. Oh my God. Oh, what a miracle. Oh, it's gonna be born on in on call. Oh, I've never had one born on call. Come on, baby. It's breach. On call and breach. Oh my gosh, I wish I had my camera out right now. I do. Do I gotta push one more time or because it's breach? Should I take it all the way out because it's breach? There, oh, good, good baby kicking. Okay, mama, give one more push. Hind hole. That's where you're gonna birth. Mm. Okay. You think she'd follow me if I go to that little grassy patch? Mm -hmm. I wonder if the little one was breech. So much for having all my puppy pads and towels ready, huh? Doesn't matter. She gonna have it when I'm not looking. And so silently without anybody hearing. Oh, look at that black one. I haven't even checked sexes on these guys. You must have been fixed. Mm. Oh, you're a boy. Well, you're gonna replace. Here's a new herd sire. <laughs> Beautiful. I wanted a black herd sire. Mm. You're a girl. Mm -hmm. And you're a girl. Perfect. We get to keep our triplets. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Time's got the best genetics in the herd. Oh, look at him. He's perfect. He's beautiful. Oh, he's got some brown in his legs, I think, too. So he's tricolor. Sweet. Sweet baby. You still don't eat the hay yet. I'm going to give you milk in just a minute. There, that slime off your face. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow, that was not what I was expecting. Wow. And Odin got to see his first babies born here on the homestead. Had it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Time.
Ryan had four babies. What a crazy day. What a crazy weekend this has been. Life and death on the farm for sure. We had two roosters we harvested this morning and uh, put in the fridge. And we had the mulch delivered. We planted strawberries. We built another pallet fencing set up for a new homestead animal. We had one baby that didn't make it. We had babies born and babies died. I tried so hard to resuscitate it. I was so hopeful, but alas, you can't always save them all. It's 80 degrees here today. <laughs> you can hear my air conditioning is going. And I'm gonna go and make sure that the third baby that was, or the fourth baby that was born, but the, the youngest is nursing because the oldest two were already nursing and the youngest had not yet when I moved them. But I wanted to show you. We've got them in this nice little shelter. For your mama. Oh, it looks like they're active. I bet you she has nursed just fine. Little boy's back there nursing. I can hear him slurping away. So I'm just gonna go in there and make sure the little girl has had hers. Wow, mama seems to have this all under control. <laughs> You're so precious. This little boy is the prettiest buckling I think we've ever had. Look, he's got the brown marking on his eyes. Mm -hmm. his legs. Oh my gosh, keeper. That's gonna be our new herd sire, hopefully. <laughs> the girls are beautiful too. They're, they're so cute. Looks like everybody's nursing and doing well. We'll let you rest. She's had her molasses water. Mm -hmm. So, she's pigging out. <laughs>